Okay. Hello and welcome to Mead Week. I'm Brian Spann. Halloween trick-or-treating got started a little early this year thanks to the USO. Hundreds of Fort Meade community members lined up on Halloween morning for the monthly supermarket suite. We'll have more on that in a moment. Also on this edition, the 2013 Army Digital Photo Contest is back. NFL star to sign autographs. And NSA Director General Keith Alexander calls for a united front against cyber attacks. These stories and more, but first... Hundreds of community residents lined up outside the Fort Meade USO on Halloween morning to receive bags of free groceries. It's all part of the U.S. Supermarket Sweeps program, a program aimed at helping active duty service members save some money on their grocery bill. The Fort Meade USO Center's Laura Dexter Moody says that the USO teams up with local food banks to provide a little farmer's market experience. We partner with the Maryland Food Bank. They come in and bring in pallets of fresh produce at the last Thursday of every month. And we bring the farmer's market experience to our military. It just helps everybody's dollars go a little further for them. It helps them to be able to take some stuff, produce home and learn about new foods that they may not have learned about either. For more information, stop by the USO Center or visit www.usometro.org. In other news, NSA Director and Commander of the U.S. Cyber Command, General Keith Alexander, spoke at a cybersecurity conference this week and called for a united front against cyber attacks. We need shared situational awareness in cyberspace. We're working that, we call that the cyber common operational picture, but we also have to have that in shared space with industry. So that's one of the key things that industry and government have to work together. How do you see the threats? Think of this as seeing packets from space of airplanes. If you have good airplanes and bad airplanes coming in, how do we sort those out? We do that for our air defense, how do we do it for our cyber defense and how do we share that with our allies? That's a key issue that we have to address. Meanwhile, if you're catching the show before Saturday, November 2nd, you still have an opportunity to meet Jarvis Jenkins of the Washington Redskins. Jenkins, a defensive end, will be at the Fort Meade Exchange on the 2nd from 1 to 3 p.m. signing autographs and taking pictures. Jenkins was drafted in 2011 and is now a Washington Redskins starter. In other news, a couple of weeks ago, we started the Healthy Chat Initiative, or HCI, a series of programs highlighting health and wellness efforts here on post. Week three of the HCI is coming your way next week. Meanwhile, in a related story, the VA talks about the importance of maintaining a healthy weight. Remember how good it felt being in shape? Joe does. Joe was cleaning out the attic and discovered his old military uniform. He thought about the old days, how it felt running hills, always ready to serve his country. Joe wants to feel that good again. He's not alone. Joe's wife, Sally, also wants to lose weight. Introducing MOVE, a weight self-management program for veterans. Your VA healthcare team is ready to help you and your family get back to a healthy weight. Your weight is a balance of what you consume versus what you burn. If you're gaining weight, you're eating more calories than your body is using. There's more than one way to participate in MOVE, including individual care, group classes, or home-based programs. You participate where you want, when you want, and how you want. Joe and Sally made changes, simple and gradual lifestyle changes. They ate more veggies and fruits, used the stairs, walked during lunch, and just plain moved. Eat wisely, move more, weigh less. And that's what MOVE is all about. Join MOVE to maintain a healthier weight for life, prevent and control many diseases and conditions, feel better, and have more energy. It takes time and effort to make these changes, so making a commitment to MOVE for at least six months is critical to success. You can do it. Read other veterans' success stories at www.move.va.gov. Talk with your healthcare team and move towards your healthy weight goals today. Finally, on this edition, the Army Digital Photography Contest is back. There are two major divisions, Active Duty and then everyone else. There are seven categories of competition, including people, military life, nature and landscapes, animals, still life, design elements, and digital darkroom. Submissions are being accepted through November 30th. For more information on the contest, go to www.armymwr.com. And that's Mead Week for this week. I'm Brian Spann. For everyone at Mead TV and the Fort Mead Public Affairs Office, have a great weekend and a great Mead Week.